you loved how the crayons save rainbows. Now we're going to make an art project with this amazing right, So the book. first thing you're going to want to do is choose a scene to put your rainbow in. I'm choosing a scene that I'm, is very familiar to me, and I'm going to see if you guys can recognize the scene I'm choosing. Remember when you're coloring to do a nice job, staying in one direction, try to cover up all those white spots. What's fun with these colors is if you want, you could layer another color on top to make a yellow green for this field that I'm creating here. So your scene can be imaginary, or it could be what you see on your way to school if you want. I'm also going to make a nice green sky. I'm sorry, blue sky. Green sky would be silly. But I'm layering a darker color on top here to give it a little more variety. Now it's time for my blue, nice blue sky. Before I do that, I might actually want to add a rain cloud in the sky. Taking your time coloring it in. You can even have the rain dropping some rain if you want. You also want to probably have the sun shining. Because remember, they have to work together to make those beautiful rainbows. you can add your rainbow. Rainbow goes in Roy G. Bib. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. So I'm going to start with the red for the top of the rainbow. A nice big rainbow. You can make your red thick or thin. Next comes orange. Then yellow. Green. Blue. Indigo. And violet. Awesome job! You made your very own. Rainbow. Can't wait to see you guys next time in art.